Legends, welcome back to another episode where I test every single vehicle that I find, that I can find, in Forza Horizon 4. The vehicle I'm testing today is the 2017 Ferrari 812 Superfast. Man, this thing was difficult to find. Anyway, I've got one from a race. Luckily they had a special seasonal event, and then I won this from the race from the championship. It's a class S1 897 rear wheel drive engine sits in the front. Let's see how it stacks up against the rest of the vehicles. So it's not exactly a grinning Italia anymore. It's now more an, of an angry Italia face <laughs> that it has. <laughs> it's really angry. Look at that. Anyway. It is an angry car. Yo, listen to that engine. It's so angry. It's just yelling. Screaming. So, off the bat, it's still quite a heavy vehicle. Feels very similar to the GT. C4 Lusso. Although, due to the rear wheel drive nature of this vehicle, it doesn't exactly want to stay in a straight line uh, as compared to the FF and the GT4, GTC4 Lusso. But it's you can see it wants to try. Like when you put your foot down, it just explodes, it accelerates. But we are struggling to tame those horses, that's for sure. Alrighty. Interior view. Very interesting. It's such an angry vehicle, it sounds so visceral. It's very twitchy. Uh, yeah, on the dirt it's quite difficult to control. But... You can still race with it. Yeah? It's just difficult. Ah. I mean, if you're not concentrating, you'll quickly lose control over the vehicle. Come on. Quick gear changes too. High revving engine. It's scary. That's for sure, it's angry at something. I don't know what. 2 minutes 36.9. So quick, certainly quick for class S1, but it can be better. Tires are holding us back here. If it was all wheel drive, this thing would have been seriously quick. That's for sure. Suspension is a little stiff for dirt, but what can you do? Put better suspension in it, of course. <laughs> anyway, let's see how it stacks up in the cross-country event. Really hoping that it would be good, but <laughs> with those tires, this, that suspension. Still spinning in third gear. So there's no shortage of, of power, that's for sure. I think that's why they call it the super fast. <laughs> mm. So it's having some 
599 issues here. engine produces so much power it's it's very nice but everything else is just working against this vehicle everything else in regarding I mean specifically the tires and the suspension and the vehicles balancing of the weight it's very light on the rear Smashed it up pretty good now. Pretty bad. Doesn't look good at all. <laughs> oh man. I think it is a little bit easier to control from the exterior view. Uh -uh. This thing. Come on. Why? Why? giving it the silent treatment. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, doesn't work. <laughs> Not cross country. Right, here's the juggernaut. The drag race. Is there hope for the 812 super fast? Man, it looks so intimidating and then it's just like... <laughs> screams and then the volume goes quieter what <laughs> yeah. I mean it is quick That's all it'll give us. <sighs> there are better cars. By uh, fifty four. Point two again. Just take the FF. Righty, final little test. Will it drift? Yes. Yeah, so it works well with the handbrake. But you don't necessarily need the handbrake for it to drift. Oops. But it will help, especially when it doesn't, you know, want to behave like that, you see. So you can kind of just interrupt it from oversteering too much. 
There you go. That's a drift without handbrake. Definitely drifts. Yes, it does. Alrighty. There you have it, guys. This has been the 2017 Ferrari 812 Superfast. Hope you enjoyed it. Like the video if you liked. Subscribe if you want to support the channel. And comment your thoughts below on this vehicle. What do you like about it? What don't you like about it? Yeah, just get the FF. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Take care of yourselves. Peace.